Hello everyone. Today we're going to be talking about the arcade one-up versions of Pac-Man. As you see here, I have two different cabinets of Pac-Man. This Pac-Man here is the original cabinet. This one comes with two games. The games are Pac-Man and Pac-Man Plus. Now this version did not come with this riser. This riser is a $39.99 option available through Walmart. And this cabinet is available through Walmart for a price point currently of $199.99. Moving on to the upgraded version. This version of Pac-Man comes with a lighter marquee, an improved screen. The improvements in the screen are it is a bit sharper and the border around the screen has far less bleed through and this one does. They're both decent screens, and you probably won't notice too much of a difference if you didn't look at them side by side, but this one definitely is the better screen. Now, looking at the control decks, nearly identical. However, this one has an addi uh, additional button right here. We'll get to that in a second. Uh, the original cabinet had three volume selections, off, low, and high. This one, however, has a more fine-tuned, precise volume, ranging from 0 all the way up to 15. Now, the volume on the original cabinet here was very loud, even on the low setting, so I'm very happy that they incorporated this fine-tuning of the volume in this cabinet. Now, this cabinet comes with four games as opposed to two. It comes with Pac-Man and Pac-Man Plus, just like the original. However, they've added Pack and Pal and Pac Mania. Now this button is an action button for Pack and Pal for activating your special and an action button for Pac Mania to activate the jump. And as you notice that this um, version of Pac-Man comes with the uh, matching custom riser as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and bring a camera in because the, the um, Backlit marquee looks washed out on my camera. I'm using my cell phone. I don't have a, a fancy uh, camera. So let me bring this camera in for everyone to see. I'm going to try to get this in focus as best I can. Oh, oh sorry about that. Let's, pull it. Let's put that down. There we go. Okay. And I'm going to get a shot of that with the lights off as well. Give you a better idea how it looks in the dark. There we go. That's about as best as I can get it. So there you have it. Is it worth a $200 upgrade? You guys let me know. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think. And if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to ask and I will answer them to the best of my ability. In the meantime, game on and enjoy.